KETV Radio. So most of us have probably never heard of the African country of Rhodesia. That's because it's only been around for about three months. Almost overnight, though, its population, estimated at less than one million people, is being decimated by a new virus called K131. Over 50,000 people, or at least five percent of everyone in the country, have been infected by this deadly virus. Even some top-ranking officials have been rumored to have left the country for fear of getting infected with this deadly disease. Good news, though, the Pfizer Pharmaceuticals has already discovered a vaccine, but they've priced the vaccine at four thousand dollars per bottle. Uh, that's about equal to two years' salary for your average Rhodesian. Outraged citizens have quickly formed into rebel groups with the intention of extorting this cure out of whomever they can get to. That being government or corporations or whoever actually has money or access. ETV news correspondent Nigel Bitterbottom was actually right in the middle of a broadcast yesterday when he was kidnapped. No by wonder some locals broken into local branches of the Pfizer to steal as much of this pill as they could find. It's now under tight lockdown, though. The Pfizer has hired the Black River Group out of Virginia to keep the remaining doses safe. This cure cost the Pfizer Corporation too much money to just give away. We are more than willing to set up payment options with these people, provided they can prove marginal creditworthiness. We need the protection of the UN. Kinda makes you wonder how much money the Pfizer stands to make from this virus.